We need to develop the calmness in our passers and the calmness in the way that they cooperate. Because as you add these seams, they need to be working together. No offense, you can't take offense. If somebody's getting in your way, you just work that out later. So we're working on seams. Um, one of the things we like to do is talk about highs and lows. And so when we have a server, Mike would be back in this corner, we have our passers face the server. So you'll notice a natural slant comes in with their feet and it's starting to give me an angle. Okay, and this was uh, Ron Arendt's years back had uh, brought this concept up to me about his defense, but I thought it worked really well in the passing. And if they put their arms out, get back, get down into a like a passing position, put your arms out. And right now we're seeing that there's angles that are presented. So as a middle back, if I followed my angle, I would be going low in front of my right back. My right back is taking high behind, and we're kind of getting what I would call a closet door. You know how they move this way, and you start to get here. And your natural angle is, I have you face them just a little bit, you're going short in front and you're going deep. This helps in the fact that, you know, if this is my left side hitter, she is definitely being able to take anything deep so she's not being pulled back. She can go ahead and cover her and she can scoot out for the position. Now, Mike, go ahead and test a couple of these out. And uh, so highs and lows, and the communication is very clear. And you hear the communication already taking place, and this is the first they've heard about this, but it's high or deep, uh, yours or mine, and you're seeing it. And um, I'm going to have you guys hold your hands out a little bit longer so that they can see exactly how those, those are, put those arms out and see. And it's just telling, especially young players, I think whose ball is whose. Now that would be whose ball? Why is it her ball? Because it's deep over her right shoulder. It's very clear and it gives you a way to communicate to your players immediately. They know the answer. You know how you ask them, who, they always turn to you. How many of you have those pastors that look at you and say, whose is it? You know, we all get the whose is it. But the fact is, they can answer these questions very clear. Mike, move over to the other side. Now they're facing Mike on this angle. And you're seeing it very clear again. Uh, go ahead. And there's a natural um, follow behind. You see two passers working together and seeing where they need to go. Oops. Okay, so for our development of this, we pretty much go through a pretty easy routine and we have all of our players in our gym doing this type of thing and it just becomes very easy with some tosses under the net and we kind of feed through uh, left back to middle back and you guys go on over this way and then feed in, feed in. You guys feed in, so after they pass, they'll come, you're off or you're over, stay there, middle back, left back. Middle back, left back, and Mike is tossing balls in this way. It's just a toss, you're passing, and then you'll go to the end of the line and you'll shift over. Just a very easy line drill. Very easy line drill. Get your plans here. And we just want to develop this so that it becomes a very natural pattern. Very easy, right there. And he's tossing into the seams, and we want to maintain good follow through, good movement on those angles. Make sure those angles exist. They call it, they're communicating every time. High, low, and get spacing, get spacing. So if I'm following him, looking at those angles, Whose ball? Whose ball? Mine. Yes. And we, we call it out and we find that this is a very easy thing to do. It's very clear. Hustle over. That's right. Short. There you go. Way to talk, Kim. All right. Shift over. And you're going to hear the, the communication in your gym start to come around. And there's a lot of responsibility, and you're figuring out who gets it, who doesn't get it, and you're able to give that communication.